Hi everyone, let's talk about what we are going to learn during this week. We will start by doing lesson 4-6, which is adding expressions. Uh, we are going to have two expressions or more and we want to simplify them uh, in order uh, to have the simplest form. Remember that I'm going to use commutative and associative properties. Uh, sometimes the coefficients uh, could be rational, rational, which means it could be fractions, it could be decimal, and we are going to add them. I do prefer to take lesson 4-6 and lesson 4-7 together, so we can uh, spot the difference between adding and subtracting. Of course, if I'm doing a subtraction for a whole Coefficient, I need to distribute the negative uh, sign for every term inside the second one. As you can see here in adding expressions, I have this is the first expression, I have here the second expression. Uh, I'm going to reorder the term, which is uh, how I'm applying the commutative and the associative property. Here, I'm going to put each like terms again together in order to get the final answer. You can see another example here, and you are going to try uh, uh, to do the try it part by your own. Okay. Here, you can spot the difference between adding and subtracting. And you see, this is the first term. I'm subtracting the second term. Okay. I have a negative one here. So, it means that I have a factor of negative one i need to distribute it first can you see here the negative one times the first term plus negative one times the second term after that i need to reorder the uh, the, the expression add like terms together in order to end with the final answer we we, uh, we will do uh, homeworks together this page you have to do it as a homework and we will review it in class regarding uh, lesson 4-6 uh, and, and you have to do this page for uh, subtracting expressions as a homework and we will review it together in class. Of course, don't, uh, don't forget to refer to your LMS. You can find videos regarding adding and subtracting expressions here. You can find that also uh, online practice. Uh, also, you can find the uh, worksheets with their answer key here and there, and a challenging question. Uh, again, subtract uh, expressions. Also, you can find videos regarding that concept. Online practice, another video. And you can find uh, online practice. And again, you can find uh, uh, worksheets with the answer key with another challenging question. Again, we will have a formative assessment on Wednesday regarding these two um, lessons. Keep the good work, grade 7, and see you soon.